Aqua. Welcome to your career and finance reading for May 2021. And now I just gave this speech to Leo and now you're getting it. All the fixed signs are getting it right now, okay? Technically you guys are getting it first though. So after, sorry by the way that your career and finance reading is out late. Um, your girl's been dealing with some pre-Mercury retrograde energy, so communication has just kind of been, you know, which is why we're having this discussion now, because um, moving forward after this last set of videos goes out, Aqua, um, your girl, okay. is going to be mixing up her schedule a little bit, so we're going to not expect still do readings but i'm gonna actually be doing them more often but i'm gonna kind of go by the signs for the retrograde season it won't be your typical standard general love read career read intimate tarot read in fact i'm skipping intimate tarot all the way all right we're not not even doing it this month it's it's gotta deal with some energy first guys okay i know i'm just not playing with this energy right now guys i've already had quite the lesson myself here this week with communication and energy and cleansing and healing and I just am not trying to go into this mercury retrograde season feeling a certain way and it already is feeling a certain way to me so we're going to see what spirit wants everyone to know and I have a feeling it's going to be worth it it will mean me going live actually more often so if you guys are into the live readings be sure to tune in it'd be a little bit more free-flowing not quite as formal as these readings are um and whatever comes up comes up we'll address it then and there okay aquas thank you for coming back to the channel supporting white crow to row as ever so happy to do these readings for you i hope something in here does resonate with you if so be sure to leave a like on the video. Returning subscribers, thank you for coming back and supporting White Crows Row. For my new subscribers, welcome. Um, see, it's the silence. It's this communication. We're just teetering on the edge. Do we? Don't we? I don't know. Underlining your spread right now is the Four of Swords in reverse. You're ready to take action. Communication. Already leading with communication with you. You want to discuss something with a partner here? Possibly? Or a soulmate connection here? An idea you have? You want to collaborate with someone? That's what I feel. You're ready. You're ready. you're not sure you're not sure you might have some tension with this person who you're thinking about maybe you walked away yeah as i said it three of swords underlining the point here eh, eh. oh i see the devil trying to pop out underneath that let me know if you're dealing with capricorn Ooh. Ooh. no queer where he is Oh, this person drank a lot. Is that why we're hesitant? Either way, you're ready to take action regardless, whether you do it, you're doing it by yourself or doing it with someone. That's how, what I feel the need to tell you. Interesting, 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 interesting. Call a truce. Truce. Okay. Yep. We're balancing out now. Two of Pentacles. I think you realize the change you need to make, Aqua, is in yourself. It's not about the other person. It's not about what they do. It's about what you do. How focused are you on your own goal here? Right? Some of you got your eyes right on it, but I feel like maybe you've been waiting for other for things to for things to be just right if that makes sense you also could be just juggling a lot at this time 
Some of you are trying to get more physically active at this time. Make a change, a personal change, like literally a personal change here. Exercise, working on yourselves. Getting back into a routine is what I just heard. A routine. Strength is beautiful. Okay. King of Pentacles, the Prince of Discs. King of Pentacles. Concerns your legacy. Interesting. Your legacy here, the day trader. Some of you... It's so interesting because even though... Even though he is a earth sign, right? The, the king of pentacles. What he does, he has to do, he works like the day trader involves communication. And we are in Gemini season now with this Mercury retrograde is all about communication. Be careful, by the way, if, if your job involves anything online, working on a computer, communication could be shit moving into this season so make sure you guys are cleansing your equipment making sure you're defragmenting your machines if you're working with computers make sure you're keeping everything up to date all right burn some incense too while you're at it just to <laughs> okay you know what i mean put some crystals by your by your on your nightstand you know or near your computer equipment just some stuff to help mitigate this energy, all right? Because some of you, I know, rely heavily on, on your online business. Some of you, may, many of you are entrepreneurs. And if communication gets messed up, which it's likely to do during Mercury retrograde season, don't sign any new contracts, all right? If you, you business is not the time right now, okay? It's not get it done before. If you're signing new contracts right now, Aquarius, or moving into new partnerships in business, get it done before the 29th or the 27th, I want to say. Get it done. All right? Get it done before retrograde season. Don't, don't do it during. All right? Because we're going to have at least four weeks of it. Okay? Uh, well, I don't know when it is, when it actually ends. I don't know if Mercury goes direct at the end of June or is it the end or is it towards the middle of July somewhere in there so guys seriously you've got new contracts new things you're doing signing into place business wise stuff that involves your home your legacy stuff you have personally invested in for God knows how long aqua get it done now get it done before Mercury retrograde all right you think I'm playing you think this energy ain't gonna mess up shit i'm trying to tell you right now all right you've also you many of you have been working at something for a very very long time and that's also why i'm telling you to do this because i don't want you to lose anything i don't want you to make some bad deal because you're decided to try to make a deal when communication is literally going to be so freaking funky all right for real you think we're not affected by the planets, guys? In what universe? This is a solar system we live in. Mercury goes retrograde. It affects communication. Okay? This is very real. So, all right? Be proactive. The activist. Be proactive in your weakness right now because you doubt it. I'm trying to tell you. Page of Swords here. Princess of Swords. All right, the activists take action. Don't watch. Don't just wait. Look, she's got the sun illuminated behind her. See this energy? She knows she's going to have to take action. Not just watch. But also, she also knows that she will be called to just watch, to not take action as we go into retrograde so take the action you need see she's pointed back at the past here too she's pointed back at you because she needs you to take action on the things you need to take action on now to avoid being interfered with okay that's the change that you're making that you're adjusting you're adjusting now 
Alrighty. Challenge. Yep. Told you. Told you. Seven of damn pentacles as the challenge here. So expect oh system failure. What did I tell you? The challenge is to avoid system failure. Okay? Guys, don't play with this. I'm trying to tell you, you will be stalled at a red light. Waiting seven weeks to come out of retrograde season. Okay, seven weeks. Just about. Just about. Yeah. Failure. Stagnation. Procrastination. Communication. Okay, that's your challenge for the next seven weeks. Seven weeks, guys. That's your challenge, Aqua. Stagnation. Can't make it up. You really cannot make it up. Oh, holy. That's why we're drawing a truce right now. We're getting ready. We're getting prepared mentally. Healing, right? The Four of Swords. We are healing, preparing our minds for this endeavor and our bodies, too, by the way. Some of you may just decide to, you know, not not invest so much in what you have to do work-wise, but just invest more in actually what you need to do on your own bodies, you know? That involves you getting into a routine of working out and just staying consistent, right? Do it. Don't worry about communication. Worry about the self, the temple, okay? Take care of it. Yeah, because we want to avoid this total ruin, right? Which you will. Ten of Swords in reverse. Gemini energy. We want to avoid that. It's in reverse. But also saying, I think you dodged a bullet here. Because your potential outcome is the Ten of Swords in reverse. Which means you avoided ruin. It's in reverse. It could have been your end, but some of you saw this coming... The Page of Swords saw this coming ahead of time, right? So you took action. You went, you went on guard and took action. Beautiful. Sorry, we spent a long time on that. Yeah, Ace of Wands in reverse on the bottom of the deck. Now is not the time if you're expecting new deals. If you're trying to make new deals, Aqua, now... Oh, hello. New deals. The world. New chapters, right? If you're trying to make deals right now, do it now. Get it done. Get it done. Close out the chapter so a new one can begin during Mercury retrograde season. Okay. All right. New opportunities coming up for you. But get it done now. Sorry to spend so much time on Mercury retrograde, guys. But guys, you see how late your reading is? There was some energy that your girl was dealing with. I had to deal with it. All right. And I'm feeling like this has almost become an excuse for me every week. And I don't like that, guys. I don't know why I every time it's like I get to the fixed signs, like I have to do their readings and then they wind up being late or I wind up not having time to do them or do them properly. I don't like that. I don't like that. You guys don't deserve that. You know, mind you, you get the reading when you get the reading, you know, <laughs> there's just nothing you can do about that. Nothing I can do about it. But I want to be more efficient. So I'm preparing even mentally myself right now, which is why I'm letting you know. I'm letting you know. I'm just letting you know. All right. Two, John. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Take action. Take the lead. Mother of Wands. Confidence making this change, working on the self, getting confident in the self. Beautiful. Beautiful. Some of you will. Some of you will take this time not to put so much emphasis on work, but more emphasis on the, on yourselves, just feeling good, doing things for yourselves, which is really great, by the way. So doing things, beautifying yourselves, pampering yourselves, doing things for you, man or woman, I don't care. I don't care what you got to do to feel good about you. If that means going to the gym and doing 10 aerobic classes, do it. Okay. It's back in Mother of Wands, please. That's really all you needed to know. Truly. 
Yeah. Confident. Get confident because that change you're making will bring you confidence. And you're, she's sitting there nesting on her eggs right now. All right, saving her eggs, protecting her eggs during this retrograde. You know what I mean? She knows when to take action. It's not, and it ain't right when she's making a change on herself, okay? Not when she's guarding the nest. No, that's not when the Queen of Wands takes action. She makes the changes necessary on herself because she's already got so much she's managing here, okay? What you doing here, King of Pentacles? Protecting your legacy because you thought in advance. Yes, I like it. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. You maybe even had to move quietly a little bit. All right. You saw something, though, in advance, but you hid what you saw because you didn't need everyone knowing your business. I don't blame you. Yeah. You saw. You were watching. Someone could have their eye on you, too, by the way. Someone at a distance from you. Some maybe you were watching online, or you were watching the the. You were watching the socks. You were watching your trades, your deal. You're just watching it. Just keep an eye on it quietly, quietly. Okay, you can manage it without having to actually be in it. And for those of you in stocks, in um. In that in the um. Let's see, I can't even get my words right now. You know what field you're in. If you're a day trader, or you're in stocks and shares and all that. Keep an eye on it. Just watch it. Watch. Watch the market, guys. Just watch the market. Don't take action right now. Just watch. Now is not the time to take action. Now is the time to watch. All right. Don't move too quickly. Watch your investment. Just watch. Look back on the daughter. Yeah. Yeah, because you're not ready to walk away, and you're not walking away. You're not walking away. You're going to wait. Wait is what it's trying to tell you. Because something will return. If something falls, it will it will rise again, okay? So just wait. Ride it out. Ride it out. Maybe you didn't have to ride it out for seven weeks if you can wait that long. Good on you. We've got the Daughter of Swords showing up here twice. You will be watching this for a minute, for just a second. Just wait. It's okay. Work on something else. Trade something else. Trade something else you don't need. Buy something else you don't need. Don't make any deals during this season, guys. Don't sign any new contracts during this season. I'm trying to tell you. Okay? Princess of Source. What you doing here? What you watching? Quietly. Both times in reverse, by the way. Both times. Could have two people. Three. Three people. It's in your work environment, too. Yeah, you're not going to be celebrating much here. Three of Cups in reverse as a weakness. So the Three of Cups, regardless. You're not doing much celebrating. Now is not the time to celebrate. That's what I felt the need to tell you. Now is not the time to celebrate, Aquarius. Now is the time... Yeah, gotta wait. Got a new beginning, a new pathway coming right after this. You gotta wait on it. And it will be online for many of you, my entrepreneurs out there especially, or you're at a distance from something. You have to travel. You need to wait to travel. Is that what I just heard? Some of you were making travel plans, but you can't right now. You can't right now. Someone wanted to return. They can't right now. Maybe need to wait about seven weeks. Again, travel, something, July, 7, July, like I said, maybe in July you'll travel, Aqua, or August, August is significant for someone, the world, yeah, yeah, travel, to reunite, to celebrate, and does that stress you out, it stresses somebody out. I'm trying to tell you, see, communication is not going to be good. You know this. It will be stressful if you try to take action right now. Nine of Swords to the Ace of Swords in reverse. This is not good communication, okay? You're in a retrograde. It's going to look crazy like this. You, you know? Don't do it. Don't. Back in Three of Cups. Yeah, it will 
if you're in a situation, a position of leadership right now at the Father of Wands, it's going to rock you for a minute. You know what I mean? We don't need that. You don't need that to happen. You don't need to be up in this Nine of Swords energy. Now, for some of you, you will be. Okay, if you see something crash, you might get worried. You might look at it and think you need to take action. Don't. Let it crash. It will rise again. you got to ride it out. I'm trying to tell you, okay? <laughs> Let that shit crash. Don't take action too soon. You will fuck up. I'm trying to tell you. You rest. You wait for the time to be right. All right? Pay attention. Because you will see failure. Expect to see failure. Don't fear this failure. Expect to see it. Because what you know in advance, you can prepare for. Expect to see it. Again, the night. All right? Chess. We're chess. Chess players here. We think 10 steps ahead, Aquarius. You see something coming in advance, you can plan for it. But what you don't see coming, you can't plan for. If I'm telling you to see something in advance, see it in advance. You will see what you need to see. I promise you. All right? We're unbothered. Because you avoid ruin back here. You avoid worry, too, in your own head. All right? People are going to be stalling at these red lights. You're going to be coasting. You're just going to be like, oh, we're good. And well, you're not taking action. You're not going to... No, sure I'm not. Not going to do it. Not going to move. Not going to make a move. Till I'm ready to make a move. Or I'm not going to make the move you think I'm going to make. For sure. And I'm not going to show my hand. I ain't going to show what's worrying me. Oh, no. Nope. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Yeah. Because we're avoiding this stroke of bad luck here. The Wheel of Fortune in reverse? It's out of your hands anyway. And that's why you're not moving. Because you know either way this wheel turns, Aquarius, it's out of your frickin' hands. There ain't nothing you can do to stop it. This wheel's gonna turn. This is the Divine stepping in. Sagittarius energy. You let me know. The divine is stepping in and saying, we're going to control this. And any way we want to flip this wheel is how we're going to flip it. So you may want to stay out of the way and not, not move. Because those who try to act foolishly, it ain't going to work out too good. Now is not the time to act. The wheel is quite literally clarifying that in reverse don't do it now okay get it done before said time and date I'm trying to tell you all right it's back in the wheel please yeah daughter of cups in reverse you don't want to be sorry later I promise you you don't want to be sorry don't want to be sorry Ooh, you will be I'm trying to tell you now I get it some of you may feel like you've got to take action do it now then because even what you will trick yourself you will trick yourself into thinking you need to do something before it's time to do it it's, and that's not all stocks and trades and bonds and all that guys you could be working your own business online and you will think you need to you will psych yourself out it's literally psych yourself out thinking you need to take action on something when you don't. Okay? Just wait. Just wait. Have patience. Wait. Again, when you know that something's going to get flipped in your favor because you're avoiding, I'm feeling like a tower moment back here. All right. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Show me clearly. When you know something in advance, you, you cannot, you don't feel the need to worry about it. Look at there. Double clarification. Ten of swords in reverse again. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. Four of cups in reverse again. This missed opportunity here. Oh, no. It was a shitty opportunity is what someone was trying to say. And we're avoiding self-pity here, too. Double ten of swords in reverse. You can't make it up. I'm trying to tell you. It's back in the four of cups. It's back in four of cups here. Bam. Happiness. Five of cups in reverse. Happiness with the chariot. Forward movement. I'm trying to tell you. Forward movement, honey. 
And that is your personal chariot to your star. That's the only one that can get you there. The chariot chases the star, chases after your star, Aquarius. That's the only person who can get to it. That's the only energy that can actually obtain the scar, the star, and it's an automatic victory. So, Cancer Energy, you let me know. We're going to take a ride on the chariot. We're going to wait. We're going to wait to take a ride on the chariot. How about that? I like it. I like it for you. You coming? You plan that trip in about seven weeks or so, okay? Seven. Number seven, the chariot. Seven, okay? Seven is the chariot. So you wait about seven weeks to plan that little trip, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Advice. Mm -hmm. Yep. Because then you can take yourself off pause in about seven weeks. Let me know if you're dealing with Pisces or a Cancer. Double water signs coming up for you. We'll take ourselves off pause. We'll come out of Hanged Man in about seven weeks. Beautiful. There it is. That'll be the end. Transformation. Let me know if you're dealing with Scorpio. Scorpio always shows up for you right at the end. Right at the end. Literally, the end. <laughs> the end. The end of the reading. Scorpio, what are you doing here? No, they're not communicating at this time. You're not talking to this person. Yeah. But you will be possibly in June. They have something that belongs to you. Felt the need to tell you that. Interesting. They were your, someone's manifesting. You're manifesting. That's you. That was you. The magician. See? Tricky, tricker, trickery energy. It'll make you think weird shit. That's you. I didn't even recognize you for a second. That's you. Magician. Oh, yeah, because you waited. Seven of Pentacles. You waited. Mm -hmm. That's you. I knew it. I knew it. I knew you were going to show up. I didn't know when, but... <laughs> uh, you see? You see? Don't. Don't second guess yourself. Don't second guess yourself, Aquarius. Oh, wow. Somebody getting married out here? Somebody getting married? Wedding. Marriage is the union of two souls joined in love, mutual respect, and commitment. It signifies a desire to deepen love over time. Your wedding day is a testament to your well-founded faith and love's power. Continually breathe life into that faith and love, dearest one. Wow. Oh, is that what I'm feeling here? Some, for some of you, that's quite literally true. This is an aside on your reading here. Some of you were planning to get married, and you're realizing you may ha run into a delay. You need to push it off for seven or eight weeks, okay? At the very least, seven, get past Mercury Retro. You don't want to get married during retrograde season. Why, guys? Why? Communication will be shit. Don't do it. Wait till after retrograde, okay? Because, you see, if you take action now, success is in reverse. We're waiting for success. You see? Energy. Energy, guys. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. Okay. We can wait, then. We can wait. Someone needed to hear that. If you love someone, wait. You can wait. We waited this long. Yeah, because nothing is set in stone right now. Mutable. Okay, mutable moon. Nothing is set in stone right now. Don't make any moves because nothing is set in stone right now. You will try to communicate something that will not fly. It will not shoot for the stars. Not this time. Not right now. No. No. Yep. There you go. Dowsing rods. You are the seeker, Aquarius. The seeker. Dowsing rods guys if anything's resonating do leave a like on the video let me know okay the dowsing rods have sought you out to announce that your search is almost over you have spent a long time 
looking in the wrong places. Now is the moment to sense through your heart using the natural elements as your guide. Doing so will point you in the right direction. Walk your path of destiny aware of the signs and the flow of water beneath your feet in the depths of the earth. Create no attachment to the path create no attachments to the paths of others for they may lead you to far more barren lands you seek your path and they seek theirs nature will guide you so get out in it and seek out the watering holes the streams and rivers and find what you need in their reflections take this kind of take i'm just trying to tell everybody take a time out take a time out don't rush anything. Don't feel like you have to rush anything. You don't. It will be fine. Even when you feel pressure to rush something, don't. Don't do it. You will be fine. Aquarius, sending you so much love. I hope this did resonate with you. You let me know down in the comments. Okay, guys? Uh, looking forward to doing my freestyle readings with you. We're not. I'm going to switch it up. I, myself, I'm making a change, guys. Aquarius, you are my north node, so I have to keep track of what's going on with you. If you're telling me not to take action for the next seven weeks, guys, I'm going to do it. I'm going I'm to change it up, so, okay. Love and light, Aqua. See you soon. Be well.